r slash ask reddit nsfw what makes you not want to have kids gestures broadly i can barely take care of myself sometimes it feels like can't possibly take on another human more selfishly there's still a lot of things i want to do that i couldn't if i had a kid lastly just a pessimistic view of the world and the desire to not want to bring new life into that my mental health and financial situation i wouldn't want to raise a kid the same way i was raised those kids who have parents that are perfectly normal but still somehow act like many serial killers it's irreversible you can't unhave kids when you've committed to it so when you have all those doubts and fears you might not be a good parent it's hard to take the plunge plus i'd have to find someone to have a kid with and make more money for it to be viable but i think they're secondary to actually wanting to go through with it money responsibility not having any good genes to pass on kids the fact that nothing really makes me want to have them i feel like you should have an overwhelming desire to become a parent i don't so why would i have a kid i would be a terrible parent not trusting myself enough that i'd be motivated enough to take care about them constantly and treat them the way they deserve edit i guess this could be interpreted as a fear of commitment or running away from responsibility but for now i am committed to my freedom i seek spaciousness watching my sister's kid get kicked out of daycare for slamming a kid's face into a table and hitting a teacher he's 3 and the most difficult kid i've met edit lol i've got reply saying he's being abused and reply saying he's being gentle parented it's a catch 22 no matter what you're either too rough or too gentle he lives at my house with his mom and sister i usually wfh no one beats him and he is regularly punished now someone's gonna say he's punished too much he just gives no fucks i've been dealing with a mentally disabled older brother for nearly all my life he's 32 yrs old but acts like a 7 year old nearly all the time i love him to death but after so long of dealing with him growing up i'm 22 i just do not have the patience to handle something like that again edit wow didn't expect this to blow up thanks for the kind and understanding comments everyone to everyone else struggling with something similar know that you're not alone it may feel exhausting at days and sometimes you might wish you weren't even in such a position but cherish those moments you share with them where they're the happiest you've ever seen them because at the end of the day you're all they have left i fear for my brother's future every day and hope that he grows up well without the need for us to care for him 24/7 pregnancy i've been clinically depressed for almost a decade postpartum depression is one of the things that terrifies me about the prospect of having kids also i am in no way mentally stable enough to be a parent after rent food and insurance i only come away with $200 a month profit which is usually eaten up by a single doctor visit or necessary car part and i live with two roommates the idea of being responsible for a human being isn't for me I don't want to have the responsibility to raise something that will end up like me. My neighbor has 7 of them. The only form of communication in that house is screaming. The teenage boy just screamed in the middle of my typing this. Kid is absolute chite at whatever game he's trying to play. My work meetings are constantly interrupted by his whiny cursing/crying sessions. Well, the total lack of wishing to have a child zero desire just like i have no desire to have a pet rhino or become a lawyer i can barely take care of myself my ex who said now you can't leave me the better question would be what would make me want to have kids and to that i say almost nothing there's far too many reasons not to have kids selfishness 
I like the freedom of being able to wake up or go wherever I want without worrying who's gonna watch my kids or my kids are awake so I have to be awake so I guess I value my personal freedom more than anything a child could provide me. All of it, the money, the time, the mental toll, the world we live in, the overpopulation, the lack of interest in kids, the lack of a partner, the presumable lack of parental skills, my own autism, the autism that my kids would probably inherit. Not wanting to pass on genetic chronic pain slash mental illness. Also kids equals no money. The screaming in the next aisle over at the grocery store because they can't have the they want. Because I just didn't want to. All the suffering I have and all life in time is enough to convince me to make the choice not to procreate. Adoption maybe if I was rich and successful. I work for Disney, and what I can say is percent 50 of parents look miserable. You're on vacation with your family, and everyone's miserable the whole time. That worries me. If your kid can't stop crying in public on vacation, how does that kid react at home? From my own experience, I don't like the thought of bringing a kid into the world we live in. I'd much sooner adopt a kid who's in a shifty place or in a struggling area. There are millions of kids starving out there, there are millions of kids being abused out there. Rather save one of them than bring another kid into this wretched place. We have white furniture. I've just never wanted any. I never played with baby dolls as a child, I never thought twice about babysitting as a teen, and I was always uncomfortable whenever people said when you have kids, as opposed to if. I never found babies cute, I can't imagine spending 24-7 with a little human, and most of all the idea of being responsible for this little creature's happiness and growth, and making sure they become a decent, functioning human being, is incredibly intimidating. Literally everything about kids and being a parent. None of that shit is appealing. Mainly I don't want to put up with them, I don't need to deal with kid shit that never stops, just changes form. I don't even want to exist, why would I want to force someone else to exist? Just seems cruel to me. The vast majority of parents I meet complain subtly about having children and how much of a struggle it is, how expensive it is, how they get no sleep, no free time etc. Then, they usually realize they can't be seen to complain about having children and finish their complaints by saying but it's the best thing I ever did. This part always feels like the least genuine bit and everything before feels like the truth. Furthermore, one of my best friends has a child and spoke candidly about it, saying I love him to bits but wish I hadn't have had a kid. Source, I'm a teacher who deals with kids and parents daily. Children are cool and all but they consume your life. They become your main responsibility, take all your love and you give it willingly, require so much money and they're just their own person. It's cool that we're able to do that and it sounds fun, sometimes. But if that's my life for the rest of my life? No thank you. I just want to be my own person. Nothing in particular. There's just something inside me that just says not. Nah. Have you met a kid? I do not want to deal with pregnancy, I do not want my perineum cut open, I don't want to piss my pants for the rest of my life. I do not have the patience to be a good mother. I do not have the skills. I was horrifically abused as a child and then dumped in the foster care system. I never ever had a sane and stable guardian, so what skills could I bring? Of course as most people's answer is that you figure it out, but I am a twice degreed social worker with extensive experience working with people who should not have been parents, and I can tell you that sometimes you do not figure it the fuck out. Money. I just got to the point where I'm positive I can have enough money to pay my bills and eat. And I'm about to turn 40 years old. If I had a child before this time, I would have been extremely stressed due to poverty, and just ended up working two jobs and never seeing the kid. The father. Takes two to make a baby, 
and I've never met a man I want to deal with for the rest of my life. I love to travel solo. I love to explore this world, well, in the before times, anyway. I would not have the time, money, or ability to travel the way I want. BPD. I can admit fully, and I'll probably be downvoted to hell, but I fully believe that if I had a child right now, 23F, I might accidentally kill it. Not because of negligence, but because babies are incessant. The cry all the time, PPD scares me. And at my worst I am violent. I know who I am in this moment and if I had a child constantly screaming with no solutions, I might cause SIDS. I can do upset and that's not great for a child. I know I can change. And I have made great progress. But right now, no. I refuse to have a child. I've been in therapy for 14 years. That's not enough time to heal. Edit. Hey guys I'm reading all of your comments. Thank you FO letting me know I'm not alone. BPD is my main diagnosis and I check all 9 categories. It's very reassuring to know that all of you are all also aware. I've been in court mandated therapy since I was 9 so I definitely have had to accept some negatives about myself and that's been the best thing for me. After what's going on in America right now I'm considering getting my tubes tied. I want to spend my time and money doing what I enjoy. I can't do that with kids. I work full time in a crash. There's no way I'm spending 9 to 6 with children and then coming home to more children. Nope. R slash kids are fucking stupid. Thought climate change would be the most obvious answer. People who are young now are gonna suffer, but kids being born now are going to face hell. Kids are unpredictable as fuck. You can do everything right and still raise Satan's seed. The world we live in. I really, really don't want to be a parent and I feel like that should at the very least be a prerequisite to having them. My grandmother didn't seem to enjoy parenthood, my mom certainly didn't. They did it because they were supposed to. I'm breaking the cycle. Gestures wildly the state of the fucking world, maybe. It's irresponsible to bring a child into the world not knowing if you can provide for them a happy, healthy childhood. And as an American, I just can't envision a future where my next of kin doesn't suffer terribly for the economic and ecological blunders of our leadership. Have you hung out with a kid 2 to 5 years of age? I love my kids but they completely ruined my life and I don't advocate for anyone to have them. Why the hell would I want to bring a child into this cruel world, I rather adopt. My vasectomy. Like, I have a kid and sometimes I'm like geez, sorry, kid. Like, she's being raised by loving parents in a middle class home in a relatively peaceful country and we want her so that's all good but shit's still burning down every summer and women are under attack and ww3 is brewing and the economy seems chaotically prone to collapsing every little while so like i'm not sure it was cool to do that do her like i'm glad she's here but yikes if literally anyone is like i don't want to have kids there's not an ounce of me that thinks so you'll change your mind, he or other shit like that. Don't want them. Can't afford them. Don't have them. It's taken me 30 years to find myself. When I imagine losing all of that identity and replacing it with a big mama bear sticker, my stomach turns. There are some aspects of having a kid that are appealing, they'll adore me, they might end up loving all the same music slash movies slash hobbies as me, they'll love and care for me when I'm old. But none of that is guaranteed and seems selfish and also not worth the gamble. Also my family generally ignores me but loses their minds around babies and if that's the only reason they would want to be in my life then no thanks. Honestly, TikTok etc. I can raise a kid how I think right but there's only so much you can shield them from the internet and I'm scared of what the future holds with celebrity slash influencer brainwashing culture. 
I feel like my generation, early 90s, was the last generation that was largely saved from this. I find them annoying. Also I have no paternal instinct, don't have the temperament to be a good parent, and I'm poor. It would be unfair to any child to have me imposed on them as a parent. I'd be a control freak out of fear, too much responsibility plus I hate crying. I think a better question is what makes you want to have kids. I usually get some bullshit touchy-feely answer about either tradition, someone to take care of them when they get old, or not wanting to wonder if they had. Edit, to everyone commenting, the question was why would you not want to have kids? I don't care why you want to. I simply answered the question. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you have enjoyed this video and subscribe to never miss an upload.